Hello everyone, welcome to Hardware Centric. Today we are going to solve your problem if you are unable to use all of your RAM in your Windows. Many Windows 10 users have discovered that Windows 10 is using only some of their RAM and a lot of memory is being reserved. An integrated graphics card is frequently associated with the hardware reserved memory and the BIOS can also set aside some memory. Hardware reserved memory, typically a portion of shared graphics memory, is generally a memory block isolated from the RAM. Many people are troubled by the Windows 10 hardware reserved memory issue. So let's dive into our computer and see what we can do to solve this problem. First we are going to check our Windows version and if it's 32 bit we are going to need to update it to Windows 64 bit. So let's click on my PC and properties. And right here we have system type which is 64-bit operating system. Since we already have a 64-bit operating system, we will not have any problem with using 8GB RAM. But if you have a 32-bit operating system, you will not be able to use more than 3.5 gigs of RAM. Now what we can do is modify our maximum memory. In order to do that, we're going to press Windows plus R and open the run box and select MS config from here. And if you don't have it, then type down MS config in your keyboard and press OK. So guys, after the msconfig window is here, we're going to click on boot and then we're going to click on advanced options. From here, tick on maximum memory and make sure the maximum memory is set to maximum. Now we're going to click OK and then apply and then OK again. I'm not going to restart my computer at the moment because if I restart, the computer will stop recording this video. So I'll restart later and you guys should also restart later and check out all the steps first. Now we're going to fix optimization for virtual memory of Windows 10. So we're going to go to Windows Explorer by pressing Windows plus E. After opening the file explorer, we are going to select this PC and now just right click on an open space, select properties and then select advanced system settings. And on the third tab, we have advanced and now we are going to select performance settings here. Now from the performance options, we're going to go to advanced settings and then we are going to change these settings. Now we are going to untick this automatically managed paging size of all drives and then we are going to select a custom size option. Now the initial size will be 200 megabytes and the maximum size will be 5120 megabytes. Now we're just going to set it. All right, we're going to click yes now. Then we're going to click OK. Now the computer needs to be restarted before they take effect. Well, OK, apply and then OK again. Click OK and restart later because our steps are not done. After that, we're gonna close this window and this also. Now, if you're running on Windows 10 64-bit operating system, make sure that your system is up to date. To check that your system is up to date or not, we're gonna press Windows I and go to settings, click on update and security, and then we have Windows update here. Now, we're gonna check for updates. Sometimes an update fixes a lot of things for a PC, so make sure to update your PC regularly in order to get all the bug fixes that Windows provides you. As you can see guys, we have an update for our Windows and make sure the update is downloaded and installed on your Windows and after that give it a restart and then all the settings will be applied. Then you should be able to use all of the RAM memory that you have installed on your computer. So guys, if you found these methods helpful and your problem is solved, then please give a thumbs up and if you still have any problem, then please do let us know down below in the comment section and subscribe to our channel for more great fixes like these. Until we meet again next time, goodbye.